Night 13 investigates has uncovered more controversy in a city in crisis. This comes on the heels of the entire Florence City Council resigning over what they call corruption. Tonight, records show the current Florence police chief was previously investigated for sexual harassment years before his agency investigated a sex scandal at City Hall. Chief investigative reporter Chelsea Brenzel is live with the latest in her ongoing investigation into corruption allegations in the small city. Chelsea. Heather and Mallory, Florence Police Chief Shane Prickett remained silent tonight after 13 investigates asked him numerous questions about his employment records with the city early this morning, specifically about how records show he admitted he sent inappropriate text messages to a city employee. Shane Prickett was hired by Florence Police Department in 2003. That's the only year city records show his employment was evaluated by his bosses. Back then, the city said it believed Prickett had good judgment, was a team player, and was dedicated to the department. Then, nine years later in 2012, Florence police called on the Pueblo County Sheriff's Office to look into sexual harassment allegations involving Prickett. In records obtained by 13 investigates, Prickett admitted to the Pueblo County investigator he sent inappropriate text messages to two female co-workers. One of the messages said he wanted to see a former Florence employee in, quote, a naughty schoolgirl outfit, piggy tails, to bring out the freak in him. It's unclear if the chief was ever disciplined for the messages. We have asked him about it, but haven't received an answer. In Prickett's files, there was also a five-day suspension without pay in 2015 for violating policies related to an email Prickett sent to the mayor and city manager about police officer shifts. Earlier this week, the Florence interim city manager, Tom Pilton's Grood, wouldn't comment about the police chief, but he did say this about personnel files. Have you ever looked at the police chief's personnel file? I'm not going to get into personnel files. Those are the expectation of privacy on a personnel file is very high. And um, I'm not going to discuss personnel files. Our investigation uncovered a pattern of sexual harassment claims at City Hall over a period of years against former city manager Mike Patterson. Patterson was fired from Florence last August. Then he was arrested in November after an investigation by Prickett's police department. He is accused of stalking and sexual contact without consent. The victims are women he supervised at City Hall. We called the Florence Police Department around 1.30 this afternoon. The police chief's son told us his dad was out on a call and would call us back. We're still waiting for that call. Chelsea Brenzel, 13 Investigates.